In today's video, we're going to go over how to have better run defense in Madden 22. When it comes to stopping the run spammers, I'm going to help you out. What's up, everybody? If you want to take your Madden 22 game into the next level, the link in the description has my ebooks, and every ebook that you get gets a free upgrade for four months. I repeat, free upgrades for four months. Let's get it. Now, the first thing you want to do, you want to make sure that you base a line when you are trying to set up run defense. Now, the way that you crash your defensive line is optional, but the key is, as you can see right here, my opponent is going to run it down my throat early on. I'm going to make simple adjustments, which is put more defenders in run fits. How do you do that? The way that you put more defenders into run fits in Madden 22 is to man people up. As you can see, my opponent is running, 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 and then he can sneak in a pass play. Looking at his center, to the right we have five people, and to the left we have five people. So he's gonna motion the guy over to strengthen up his left side and then he's gonna run the ball. And this is what run bums do. They run and celebrate. Seven to seven ball game. My opponent has the ball two minutes and 42 seconds left. How are we gonna start stopping the run? Like I said, putting more people into run fits. So you're gonna start seeing me cross man they're going to be able to mix in passes when they are in heavy sets like this they're going to mix in passes so we're going to cross man that safety now you can see more people are attacking the ball okay so we have our official front four and then we have a cross man from the top and then we have a manned up wide receiver with a cornerback so the only people not in the run fits is the purple zone and the blue zone. So we have six to seven people going aggressively at the ball. You can see my opponent has 12 rushes, straight bum mode. So right here, we got cross man. We got both of the linebackers crossed over to the tight ends. We got their safety in the deep crossed over to the running back. So we got three people not in run fits and everybody else is gonna be aggressive coming down to the run gaps, okay? So fourth and nine right here, I should have expected a short pass. He caught me off guard. I thought he was gonna run it on fourth and nine. So here we go, first and goal, and I am shooting the gap aggressive. I found out how to get more people to commit to the run, and now I can come down and fill wherever a gap is at. If it's a pass, it's either going to be a quick corner by the tight end or a quick corner from another person. Now, second and goal, nine seconds left. That means he can't call a timeout or stop the clock. Now, I'm going to play the clock. I have bum defense, okay? I'm playing a bum and I'm playing bum defense. That means two spies and a bunch of coverage across the middle. And this is why people who run the ball over and over and over 18 to 25 times a game does not like to pass. Now, we are on offense and this is my breakdown that I just showed you guys a sneak peek of yesterday. So if you don't have the ebook or the Patreon where this full offensive scheme will be broken down. You need to make sure that you get it. So seven to seven ball game, you want to control the clock because your opponent is a run heavy opponent, okay? You want to control the clock, but you want to kind of get in your opponent's head so he can get super aggressive. Instead of him running the ball, now he's going to have to mix in more and more passes. Right there, I miss a low ball pass that should have been an easy touchdown and right here we have a 6-5 wide receiver that's going to dive and get the ball right past the pile line okay so now when we come back on defense against the run bum up one score at the end of the third quarter he's going to run the ball a few times but he's going to have to pass more in order for him to get down and score it usually takes him about 
four and a half to five minutes. So that means that the clock is against them with only 22 seconds left. The clock is dripping. He does a quick out route with the tight end right there. So we have perfect defense. He gets three or four yards, fourth and inches. I go into my cover six shell. This is broke down on the Patreon. So I take that soft squat into a cloud flat. He's gonna drift back a little bit and I'm remembering that out route by the tight end was what was open last time. So I move this guy over. He's going to look and see that he has an outside release and we make the perfect adjustment. Make sure that you man up people to get better run fit integrity. And then when the run bums are forced to pass the ball, you can use my defensive scheme on my Patreon and in my ebooks. Let's get it.